How do I even put this into words? I cannot believe what happened today. February 14th, 2014. I managed to raise at least $3,500 part of my Mac Pro campaign on Indiegogo over at davidfranco.com slash Indiegogo. I cannot believe what is happening right now. Guys, we raised $3,500 all thanks to your incredible generosity, your amazing support. Just the fact that you're nice enough to donate a dollar towards a new computer for me. I, I don't even know what else to say. I gotta be honest, this is my third take because I felt like the first two takes were a bit too much. I was like, oh my God. Thank you guys. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Because of you, I'm going to have a brand new setup. I, I just cannot believe I did it within a day. Because this is the thing. When I was setting up the campaign, I was like, okay, wait, a max of 60 days? I don't even know if that will be enough. And guys, I honestly mean that right now. I, 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 mean, I wasn't even sure if I could make $3,500 in 60 days. But I made it in, let me say, uh, 12, probably eight hours. Maybe, maybe nine hours. But the fact is we made it in less than 24 hours, and that's the thing. It's not even close to ending because I emailed Indiegogo support today uh, saying, hey, uh, basically my campaign is gonna end a lot sooner than I expected to, maybe like 59 days ahead of time. And I was wondering if I could end my campaign early because I don't wanna take well, you know, take too much of people's money because I would honestly feel bad. But then they said, no, sorry, you can't really end your campaign early. But either way, congratulations. So, the factor, the fact, I can't even, what, what is that, the factor, really? The fact of the matter is this, guys. The campaign cannot be ended. So any more donations that come in beyond this point, please know that I greatly do appreciate it. I appreciate every single donation, whether it's a dollar, ten dollars, one hundred dollars, or five hundred dollars. It's just incredible the fact that you're willing to help me, just an average person on YouTube who has been creating content since July of 2006. Over 1,200 videos, nearly 100,000 subscribers, and all of this is happening because you decided to sit down one day and click that subscribe button. It's just incredible. So you're probably wondering what will happen with the, you know, the extra leftover funds. Well, basically all that money, or at least most of it, depends on how much I get, will be going towards cables and adapters, uh, which I'll need to support my displays on the, on the new Mac Pro since it only has one HDMI port, but it has six Thunderbolt 2 ports, which can be used for a large variety of gadgets, as you probably know. Um, and yeah, I, 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 don't re I don't even know where to go from here. Th this is just amazing. I don't know if I'll be putting the money towards the six core model yet because my plan was originally to go with the four core model. Um, but if I get enough money, maybe I'll up to the six core model. But I could probably benefit more from a Thunderbolt display, 27 inch Thunderbolt display at that. I'm not going to go into detail right now what I'm doing with my current Mac Pro. Yes, I am keeping it because I actually do need it uh, for, for my work in certain projects and, and my data storage. Um, I'll explain that in detail in future videos. But guys, do know, again, I'm not trying to just repeat myself, but do know that I appreciate each and every one of you who have donated and all the kind support I received throughout this campaign. Yes, I've received a lot of backlash and a lot of haters and unsubscribers, but you know what? That's honestly fine by me because going into something that asks for donations, obviously I expect that kind of response, uh, but that's okay. It's the positive people like you who I'm truly focused on. So thank you guys again. Enjoy the weekend vlog. I know this has been a very long intro, but something like this is practically a once in a lifetime moment. I never thought this would be happening, especially in less than 24 hours. I'm just still blown away. That noise you hear is Jasmine.
Oh, by the way, if you haven't realized, I'm at my parents' house. I know that's pretty obvious, but I'm watching Jasmine for the night while my parents are in Atlantic City for the night. Um, but, yeah. Guys, thank you again for like the 18th time, and enjoy the weekend vloggity vlog. Jasmine, isn't this incredible? I cannot believe what has gone down today. And yes, her eye is still sewed shut, but she's doing great. I mean, she is herself. She's her complete self, her freaking amazingness, cute pug self. I'm throwing words together that don't even make sense together. But the point is, Jasmine is the same old dog. She just happens to have one eye closed. Hello, everyone. This is Dark David, where you cannot see my face. Hey, smoke a dope. Speaking of smoke a dope, what the? Oh, hold on. Rare mo. How do you turn these freaking lights on? Here we go. No, Hansa. Shh. Mitzi's here. Rare moment, guys. Get ready. Look at that. They're sleeping together. Guys, you rarely get to see Mitzi this close. Oh, Mitzi, hi. Oh my God. You're a beautiful kitty. Oh my God, look at you. Mitzi, I rarely get to pet you. Oh. Sorry, I'm like catgasming, if that's a word. There's Autumn. Shady. Look at that face, guys. She's so good. Cute. Your feet are definitely smaller than Maui's, which is interesting. Mitzi's basically Maui, but opposite in terms of black and white, like all, all of her black is kind of white on Maui. And then her white is black on Maui. He awakens. Hey Shane. Autumn, what are you doing over here? You playing with balls? There it is. Ready? Get it. Oh, it lights up. That's pretty cool. Ready? It's the small things in life. Hey Shane. How are you? Good boy. Look at that booty. Alright, so something very interesting is happening right... I still don't know the lights. Something very interesting is happening right now. I'm getting payments already. In PayPal. Because I met my goal. But that's only if people funded my campaign using PayPal. Hey, Mr. Pants. Well, I don't know, I'll let you out in a bit. But for the contributors who paid via credit card or debit card, I believe, I was reading their FAQ on their site, I don't get paid those contributions until the campaign ends, which is 60 days from today. So the thing is, I have two things of donations coming different ways. I have to be careful to have my PayPal contribution set aside, which I will, because um, I usually have auto pay on for like Wufu.com and other services, Netflix, but I'll change them to my debit card temporarily, so that way it doesn't take out any of the money. Uh, but either way, don't worry, I'll be watching it very, very closely, so I have at least $3,500 coming my way. I, I, I still can't believe it. This is just incredible, guys. I promise you, it will be worth it. I will not let you down. I'll create tons of videos, and I might even start putting out my weekend vlogs earlier instead of 2 p.m. every Monday, which is what I usually go for. I might put them out at 10 a.m. So I think that helps the uh, people in the UK and whoever else is ahead by like five, six, or maybe even eight hours. Mr. Pants is in jail. Let's just say hi. Ew. Don't be licking my lens. Stretch! Because of Jasmine's eye, we really can't have Hunter and Jasmine in the same room, at least when we're not near them. Because one scratch at Jasmine's eye could rip out the stitches, which would not be good. Because believe me, my parents have been paying some pretty hefty bills for Jasmine, but it's worth it. Oh, it's on my screen, not my lens. Good. Hey, Aud. Make the jump. Good girl. I give it a 9 out of 10. That was pretty well done. Autumn.
This is gonna kill me. Waiting until 60 days from now? Why did I make it so long? I know, I know, TWSS. But seriously, 60 days isn't that long of a wait. Um, if anything, it gives me more time to get the perks ready for those who contributed at least $5. Because uh, you know, you, you get your name on the site. I know, the floor is very noisy, hear that? And it also gives me time to maybe order the Mac Pro ahead of time because, as you probably know, Apple doesn't charge you. They don't actually charge your account until said product is acknowledged and shipped. And as of right now, as of this video on February 14th, Mac Pros are still not shipping until April. So if I wait 60 days from now, there's a very good chance that my Mac Pro wouldn't ship until maybe at least June. So I think it is smart to order it maybe like a month from now. Oh, okay, you know what? Maybe I'll order it 30 days ahead of the campaign um, ending, like exactly a month. So I'll do it on March 15th. Does that sound good? Um, I know you're not the one ordering it, but I just want your opinion. Do, do you think ordering it a month ahead of time is good? Because I could technically put on my credit card and then pay it off with PayPal, so it's like they never charge my credit card. I don't know, now, now I'm just talking a lot. Anyway, the original reason to come down here was to get a Mountain Dizzle. This is from the Super Bowl parte we had, as well as my Cheetos that I got from Wawa. Jammy on! And look, we are currently at $3,572. Let's do a refresh. It should be the same. It's kind of slowed down a bit for obvious reasons. Let's see. Yes, $3,572. But what's even cooler is I still had people saying on Twitter and Facebook that they are willing to donate even though I already hit my goal. That's just incredible. I mean, if I make it to like $4,000, maybe I will bump it up to the six core model. But like I said, I think I'd rather want a, 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 a new display. Talking too fast. Because the quad core model as it is, is more than I need, I think. But then again, maybe the six core model should be, I don't know. I have a lot of time to think, so that's a good thing. Jasmine, what would you go for? Quad core or six core? or 12 core, or 96 core, or 1,000 core. What the heck could you do with a 1,000 core computer? Probably launch a space shuttle, although you could probably do that with a dual core machine. Now you could probably do that with a single core machine. Why are we talking about launching space shuttles? Chris Perillo is such an awesome supporter. Look at this, newsflash, if you don't want to support David in the way he's asking for support, STFU, I'm pretty sure you all know what that means. And don't support him in the way he's asking for your support. No, seriously, SDFU. Actually, he just commented, I'm not sure that these haters are haters so much as they're simply ignorant. Yes, ignorant. And now Chris is actually messaging me on Facebook. I love having a personal connection with certain people online. It's just really cool. Uh, but anyway, Chris, thank you so much for your kind words. I appreciate how open minded and how outspoken you are. I've always respected about I've always respected that about people. It's getting late. I can't talk, but basically thank you so much. I really do appreciate your support. And again, congratulations to you and Diana on her pregnancy. That's just simply awesome. I know you guys are gonna be awesome parents. And I gotta be honest, I am very intrigued to see you raise a kid. It's gonna be really cool because I've never seen that on video before. Uh, in in your in your videos anyway. So that's just gonna be really cool to follow. So congratulations again, and I cannot wait to see what happens from here on out, both with your baby and my campaign and everyone's support. We truly do live in an awesome world. We really, really do. Snot. Sorry, it sounded like you said it's snot. I'm so sorry. Okay, so killing yourself. <laughs> what you think about snot? <laughs> <laughs> I love Erin, she's just so cute. Ellie Kemper, is that her name? Ellie? Like in The Last of Us. Ellie Kemper. Yes. There she is. And she was recently married, which is what I was going for. Um, she's 33 years old. She does not look 33. I'm 28, and I thought she was around my age. Yeah, we're not that far off. What, five years? But still. Because if Holly chooses to be with him, he will be so, so happy. 
And if not, he'll be avoiding the biggest mistake of his life. I just love the show so much. Anyway, tonight has been awesome. Not only did I complete my Indiegogo campaign, <laughs> and again, less than 12 hours, but now The Office is on TV. I'm going to go have a cup of coffee. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. You know me? I'm going to be up late. I'm not going to bed anytime soon. And plus, I have a lot of emails to answer. Look whose birthday it is. Kristen, happy birthday. Love you very much. You are my favorite sister. My only sister. But seriously, I hope you have an awesome day. I doubt you're going to see this. You have a very busy life going on nowadays. But still, happy birthday. I'm really, really lucky to have such an awesome sister. And I'm glad how far we've come. Um, my viewers don't really know this, but Kristen and I used to fight a lot. We used to not really get along. We used to fight and just shut each other out in the playhouse and just get just get each other in trouble. But over the years, as, as we've matured, I've honestly felt like we've gotten a lot closer. Uh, so, Kristen, shout out to you. Happy birthday. And I hope you have a good one. Or had a good one by the time you see this. It's Monday. Jingle jangle. <laughs> Autumn's getting big, guys. Look at her. She's getting big. Although she's still got that kitten look. Don't you, Autumn? Come here. Yes. Yes. Look at that fairy coat. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, look, Zoe, just to clarify here, my dad worked for IBM, so we... She's so cute. Well, we always managed to have friends. Don't go on my shoulders. That would hurt like a mother. No, mom, it's cool. I told you. Oh, we'll go near Jasmine and she'll attack. Pet drama. Oh, sorry, you don't like that? <laughs> Alright, what do you say we go downstairs and finally let Hunter pants out if by now he hasn't pooped his pants? Alright, come on, Hunter. Let's go. Yes, let's go, as Mario would say. I just sent this picture to Kristen. I'm sure she's gonna love it. He's a pacing, which means he's about to be a pooping. And he jumps on me. All right, Hunter, let's go outside. But let's put my jacket on because I don't know how cold it is. Well, let's say Siri. My guess is, you know what? Why don't you comment below? Fahrenheit, guess. I say it's 20. 28 degrees. What's the current temperature? It's Bert? 34 degrees Fahrenheit oh, outside. 34, that's not cold. At least to around here. I hate how Siri says burp. They should add like a couple more R's so she's like burr instead of burp. 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 Getting emails. I got paid $1.72 by Machinima. <gasps> Guys, that's a cup of coffee. Huge success. Hunter went out to pee and poop, and Jasmine just went out to pee. Jasmine, yeah, you're so cute. And they're swapping places, so now Jasmine's gonna sleep down here, and Hunter will sleep upstairs with me since he's been up since he's been down here all night by himself. Sorry, Jazz. But thankfully, Jasmine does like it in her cage. She just feels safe there. And plus, I can't abandon Hunter pants all night. He's been down here for at least a few hours while I was doing my Indiegogo campaign. So. I was worried for a minute. I was like, crap, I forgot to bring K-Cups here because I live off K-Cups. I just love them that much. But then I saw this. Not only are there three K-Cups on the very bottom, but they're Wawa K-Cups. Need I say more? So I was just looking at my Indiegogo campaign, the funds in the dashboard view that's only accessible to the admin, um, also known as the creator of the campaign. And I gotta say, the majority of my funds were submitted via PayPal. And I've already saved. Saved? I didn't say saved. I've already received. Maybe I did say it doesn't matter. A handful of funds via PayPal. I mean, I already have some of that money, which is awesome. And some of my largest contributions were via PayPal, which I don't have yet. But what I'm getting at here is maybe I will have these funds sooner than expected. And if that's the case, then I can order the Mac Pro much sooner than expected, and I don't have to wait until the campaign ends. So that could be awesome, because I gotta be honest, 60 days, I know it's not a long time, and I'm sure time will fly by, because it's gonna be summer before you know it. I'm just saying that, because in relation to time. 
and it's gonna be Christmas before you know it. 60 days is, I mean, it feels like it's a while away. But, uh, yeah. What? Whitney Lynn just tweeted, shoving people in trunks. Happy Valentine's Day. Whitney, I'm concerned about you. If you're watching this video, tweet me telling me you saw it. At Catastrophic actually made me my Twitter avatar, which is awesome. She's very talented. There it is. There's proof right under Uncle Jesse. Would you look at that? My smoke -a dope is chilling with me on my lap. Yeah. You're so cute, Smoke. Don't have a change. What's that from? Don't have a change. Anybody who gets that in the comments, you get a cookie. You get a nice sugar cookie. Oh God. And that's how you know it's 2.32 in the morning. Good morning, Hunter Pants. Oh God, yes. Why don't you tell them the awesome news? Guys, I couldn't sleep. I only got like four hours of sleep. Because I woke up to over one, oh my god, <laughs> hold on. I woke up to over 100 notifications on my iPhone going crazy. And I apologize for this image, I just had to tell you right away. Apparently I was paid. I was paid by Indiegogo. There is almost $3,500 in my PayPal account right now. And there's more on the way because they pay in, uh, what's the word? Disbursements, I guess I guess it's the right word. But either way, the point is, guys, I got paid already. So I can order the Mac Pro, like, tonight. Which is amazing. That way I can get ahead because, again, like I said last night, they're not shipping until April. So I'm going to order the 4-core model tonight. Yes, I realize the 6-core is kind of like the sweet spot. But I just don't have enough money for the 6-core. I don't want to take advantage of the funds and wait even longer because I'm going to order this thing right away. Um, and get this. The CPU is actually socket based, so in other words, I can upgrade the processor myself one day. So I think it's better money spent if I go with the 4-core model now. And as I was mentioning, or briefly mentioning anyway, last night, any extra funds that come in will be used for cables and or adapters. That's a scary picture behind us, yes, we're, yeah, that's a kind of like family joke nowadays. Um, or the extra money will be used towards a Thunderbolt display which could benefit me quite a bit because I'm moving my current Mac Pro setup into my bedroom. That's a whole other video. I'll talk about that in a video, in a, in a, in a future video. But anyway, I just, wanted to, I, I, just, I just wanted to fill you guys in. I can't even talk. I'm so excited. Um, so I will most likely be ordering the Mac Pro tonight, and this means I have a lot of work ahead of me. For the rest of the day, at least when I get home later, I will be working on the perks. This means getting your names on the website, um, getting the pre-rolls done. Well, some of the pre-rolls done. depends how much time I have left. Uh, the video is done, all that stuff. So, guys, thank you. Stay tuned. Many more updates to come. I have such a tough decision to make. So, apparently, Lee Navarrete says, I love the quad, quad core option. I've sold many machines by displaying the insane amount of power um, it has when I export a 13 gigabyte Final Cut movie in under 35 seconds. I'm assuming it works at the Apple Store. So, he's saying the four core model is awesome. But then we have Michael Panzika says, uh, saying that I should wait because there's still 60 days to go, which is true. So maybe I should bump it up to the six, to, to the six square model. I don't know what to do, guys. Part of me says I don't want to rush it. Maybe I should just wait 30 days, not 60 days, but 30 days. 30 days is a lot of time um, to get the funds in the campaign because I think by the time 60 days comes around, the campaign kind of like you know flattens out. So maybe I will just wait 30 days. Hmm. Okay, it's decided. 30 days, that's a nice midpoint. I actually feel good about that. That just feels confident because 30 days, in my opinion, is a nice midpoint. That gives me plenty of time to decide what I really need out of this. Uh, so I might opt in for the six score if I have enough by then. And then between the time period of 30 days and 60 days, Whatever funds I gather between those days, I will most likely use towards a large display. Not 4K. I don't really need 4K yet. Eventually, one day, I'll buy 4K. Uh, maybe like two or three years from now. 
Um, but I'm talking like maybe either Apple Thunderbolt display or a Dell display because I actually do like Dell displays a lot. So I think I'm decided. 30 days. What do you guys think? And check it out. We are currently at $3,882. This is an awesome indication that I'm going to have easily enough for the six core model. Because I will admit, I'm arguing with myself over here. Like, David, do you need six cores? But a lot of people on Facebook have convinced me. Six core model is definitely the sweet spot for what I do because I'm definitely a power user. I, I'll be pushing projects through my Mac Pro. I'll be multitasking like a mother. So six cores could definitely benefit my workflow. All right, what do you say we fix this? What do you say I get in the shower? I'm not bringing you guys with me. Um, and then I'll have coffee. And then I have a lot of work ahead of me today. I have a lot of work since I was paid already. I'm going to be doing the perks. So, but it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Don't forget, davidfranco.com. Go there and you'll see the link for the Mac Pro Contributors page. At least by the time you see this video, that page should be live. Ah, uh, much better. Listen to this. This is Final Fantasy, but doesn't it make you think of Willy Wonka? It's kind of creepy. I love it. Anyway, guys, I always have to look outside. I'm getting text messages. Um, yeah, I showered. So hopefully I look a lot better for you. I can't stop thinking about my Mac Pro. So six cores are definite. I don't know. I know, Jazz, on a chill. I don't know if I'm gonna go for the six core base model. That's $4,000, that's a lot of money. Or I'm gonna go for the four core model upgraded to six cores, which is 3,500. So $500 less than 4,000, that's not bad at all. And I don't know if I need the extra GPU horsepower. We'll see. Again, it entirely depends. Notice I pace, I'm trying to get away from the noise. It entirely depends on how much money I have in the campaign by 30 days from now. So, you know what? Watch this. Set a reminder 30 days from now saying Mac Pro. Here's your reminder. Shall I create it? Yes. Okay, I'll remind awesome. you. Awesome, March 17th, Mac Pro. I love Siri, she's so convenient. So there you go. Again, stay tuned. This is probably like the third time I'm telling you that. Okay, it's coffee time. Jam on, jam on, jam on, chill. Easy. You okay? Hi, baby. Come here, Jess. Hi. She's a little hyper. Good girl. Hunter, stay away from her eye. Hey, Autumn. Pants. Such a good song. By the way, look at all the PayPal emails I got. Guys, these are all PayPal emails. Isn't that incredible? It's just amazing, and they keep on coming in. And I'm skipping breakfast. I don't feel like having breakfast, but I will be having an, an egg salad sandwich later. So shout out to Wawa Mama for leaving egg salad for me. Then I'll leave here later, because um, I got a lot of work to do. And I might stream over to FrancoGaming.com slash live. I'm thinking about doing a PS4 stream. I just don't know what game to stream. Maybe I'll, hmm, I don't know. Maybe I'll start over on Outlast again. But then again, the Last of Us DLC came out on Friday, yesterday. I think I'd rather play that, but that's on PS3. I can't stream that, because it's not configured right. Pants, you have such a tough life, don't you? Give him a kiss. <laughs> really, Autumn? You attacking his tail? Come here, Autumn. Oh my god. <laughs> There's gonna be a showdown. Jasmine's like, I want in. I want in. Jasmine, you're too freaking cute. I cannot wait to see what the Mac Pro is going to look like on my desk. It's going to be so small. I'm going to save so much energy and money. My electrical bill should see a nice little decrease. Hey, guys. I know it's good to play, but we got to protect your eye, Jasmine. Hunter, get. Sorry. 
when her eye is all better, then then you guys can play. But until then, you gotta be extra careful. But yeah, it's gonna be really nice having my setup minimalist deck. I always minimalist. Let's just say my setup's gonna be simpler than ever, which is a good thing. I'll probably still have dual displays. That's a that's a concern I'll worry about later. I'll pay for that myself. That's not too crazy. Um, but I'm thinking of starting out with just one larger display, just to see how I can get a get by with that. But I really like dual displays. I don't know how I'll live without dual displays, especially with the kind of work I do. <sighs> that's okay. I have time to decide. That's the good thing. I have options. Wawa K cups are so loud. Listen. Oh, that one was actually kind of quiet. Must contain anger. Boom! One more drip! You can do it! One more drip! Come on! Here, let me hit it. There you go. <laughs> the old myth of hitting your electronics and seeing if it works again? Yeah, I would, I would say it's still pretty valid. Seriously, it is. I'm not gonna talk about this too much anymore because, you know me, I like to concentrate on positivity and the people who truly matter. But, hear me out. I'm gonna read something I just posted on Facebook. Don't worry, it's short. It's only three paragraphs. Regardless of making everything crystal clear prior to my Mac Pro campaign, I have still managed to upset many people, and that's perfectly understandable. This sort of thing is bound to invite the naysayers into the mix. That's life. However, please know this. I will give back someday. You'll see. I'm not as low and disgusting as you probably think I am. This campaign would not have happened if so many people weren't on board to begin with. It's exactly why I talked about it two weeks ago in a vlog. And for those who understand me and my motives, thank you. This campaign is shining the light on those who truly support me and understand me as a person. So thank you. We just passed $4,000. We are at exactly $4,044. Amazing, guys. You are amazing. And you know what? I'm dedicating this vlog to you, hence the title below. I think I'm going to call it You Are Amazing, or You Are Incredible. Something about you. We'll see. She's always been eating for two, <laughs> but now there's really a second th uh, thing, but th a person in her. You know, it's amazing. We don't really think about this often, I bet, but the fact that a person can grow inside of a woman, that's just... Incredible. Everybody. It's the miracle of life. It truly is. It's just and awesome. Think about that. A human being is quite literally growing inside of you. Like a plant. But better than a plant. Anyway, as you can hear and see, I'm watching Chris Perlow and Diana Perlow's new vloggity vlog. Um, and I am making myself an egg salad sandwich for lunch. And then, probably taking a nap. I'm so tired, guys, and then I'll probably go home around 5, because I want to sleep for at least a couple of hours. By the way, I don't know if I said this last night when I mentioned Chris, but he was nice enough to donate $100 to my Mac Pro campaign. So, Chris, thank you so much. Your support is just awesome. I really, really do appreciate your presence in terms of being here, presence with a C, and your um, content, because you've been doing this a lot longer than I have in terms of on the internet, you know, blogging and stuff, so much respect. Yes. On Egg salad on toast. Oh, like Love it. Autumn may be freaking adorable, but she's a devil cat. Alright, so lunch is complete. I was waiting until I was done eating, so I know I had an egg flying all over the place. <laughs> Could you picture? Egg, 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 egg. Anyway, I was making my egg salad sandwich, walking to the toaster, you know, from there to there, like six, seven feet. I'm walking through. Autumn's right here. Now Smokey is. Autumn jumps on my back, swings around, almost falls off me, then climbs up me more. I'm literally shaking her off. Then I have to do this and dump her on the floor. It's fine. It's not a high height. She always lands on her feet. Hurt like a mother. 
So I was like, okay, whatever. I said a few curse words, made myself feel better, because that's a scientific fact. Cursing does actually make your pain feel better. I don't recommend it, but still, if you're, anyway. So I walk back again, you know, get in a sandwich once it's done toasting, so I'm, you know, the uh, bread. She does it again. She jumps on my back even worse this time. Hurt like a mother. I had to shake her off again. I don't even want to see my back. I mean, it's probably full of scratches. It's hurting right now. Actually, let's see. Can you see it? Oh my god, yes! Look at that! Wait, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, you can sort of see. Hurts like a mother! Oh god. Autumn? I love you though. Ow, you. Autumn. Psst, psst, psst. Then there's my smoke a dope. Hey, guys, don't fight. And yes, I realize there's probably at least one person freaking out right now. David, there's cats on your counter. Guys, don't. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Appreciate each other. But anyway, this is the DeFranco household. It's pretty much impossible to keep the cats off the counter. I'm going to have a Mountain Dizzle. Rare moment. I'm just trying to get to this box of cans that we had for the Super Bowl party um, a couple weeks ago. So um, I'm going back upstairs. I'm going to try to take a nap after drinking this Mountain Dew. We'll see what happens. Mr. Pants. See you, Mr. Pants. Then whatever happens, whatever happens. And yes, I did start the weekend vlog early. Um, I started it Friday night, as you probably know by now. And today's only Saturday. So this weekend vlog will probably be at least an hour long. But that's a good thing. I like producing long content. Well, this is a pretty sight. I just woke up from a much needed nap. Yes, I slept in my parents' bed. It's comfy, who cares, right? And they have a good TV in front of me, just chill. I've uh, actually been watching Friends. So shout out to Chris and Ziff. I know your friends is like my The Office. Was that noise on the TV? I just heard my text message sound. Where am I hearing things? I don't know. Anyway, my nap was good, much needed, because again, I only got four hours of sleep last night. Because uh, I woke up to all the donations coming into my phone, which is a good thing. That's truly a good thing to complain about, trust me. Um, and yeah, so I'm just gonna wait here for a little bit until my parents get back. They should be back in less than an hour. I'm gonna have another egg salad sandwich just to hold me over and stuff like that. And then I'm going back home to probably stream on my PS4. I'll probably just use the Playroom app because that's a good way of just showing my face or whatever full screen and I'll just chat with the chat room. So good times ahead. Just look at her. Sorry, Jazz, my iPhone flashed you. Snapchat. From Norway. I gotta say, it's really cool. Shout out to my friend Anne, who I've been Snapchatting all the way from Norway. It's incredible, the people and the friendships that I've formed over the years. So, I wasn't just saying that in, in my uh, Mac Pro video. I mean, I do honestly mean that. I've met some new people because of my content creation. And that right there, it's just awesome. It's something I really appreciate. The emails are still coming in. I really had to start packing uh, my stuff up. But anyway, as you saw, I have over 180 emails. Most of them are donations that I'm gonna go home and clear out, then organize my perks and start working on the perks after I stream on PS4. But I want your guys' opinion on something. Um, a viewer by the name of Sean, thank you again, Sean, for showing me this. I've heard of it before, but I keep forgetting it all to be a, like a current, dis uh, current discount, a current student. Basically, for those not aware, Apple does have a student discount program where you could save literally a few hundred dollars on the Mac Pro if you use a specific link. What do you think? Is it dishonest for me to use it because I would actually kind of feel bad because the Mac Pro is technically free as it is because of your generous donations? Or should I save a few hundred dollars anyway and use that money towards maybe a Thunderbolt display or an, an external hard drive or two. What do you think? Comment right below. I don't really want to take advantage of this opportunity um, in a bad way, but I do want to hear what you guys have to say. It's getting kind of dark out, but before it gets too dark out, I just wanted to show you guys the snow real quick. Look how deep it is. Hold on. I'm going to go way back here. Actually, no. Let me go left. I almost fell. It's really deep right here, and it's so funny when Hunter steps in it. 
but he's inside for now. Here we go. Nice. <laughs> Love that. That's really deep for South Jersey. And yes, if you can't tell, it's snowing again. Very light snow, but guys, I gotta say, this is insane. We've not gotten this much snow in terms of the total accumulation in years. We usually get gypped. So I'm very happy about this. And look, the heater's doing great in the pond. It's not frozen. So the fishies can stay warm. Mom and Dad should be home any minute because they went to Wawa. Don't fall on the steps, they're slippery. Really? A little thing got in the way. Very nice, very nice. Closing door. I have seven minutes left on this battery. But I do have my spare with me. Unlike last weekend. Jamion, chill. My lord. She was just outside. Again, they can't be together just in case Hunter scratches her eye. Okay, Jasmine, I'm letting you out in a minute, I promise. I told you you were not cleaning in Boston. Wasn't Dad a lot more chill in Boston? Mom and Dad are home. Mom, how are you? The really? case is open. Yes, you can open. <laughs> Dang. Very feminine. Mom, how are you? Good. Why don't you tell them the good news? Army. Yes. A little guy, very little guy. Oh, very Mac Pro. Thanks to yes. you, thanks to your loyal fans out there. Yes. As I Mr. Bantha says, I the understand what you're doing, what you're about. To Frank is a winner. If I don't understand what you're doing and what you're about, I suggest you go to college and get educated yeah. in marketing and management. Because those of you that are haters are just a bunch of buttheads. You don't. Do, people. His that, words, not mine. People that <laughs> speak without understanding what they're talking about are a bunch of assholes. Can you say that? Yeah, I don't care. I they don't. are. Oh, stop it! Oh. Oh, Can I fight? God. Oh, guys, stop. Smoking. It's not worth it. You're hungry. Oh, she tried to blame me. Who? Oh. Autumn. <laughs> but anyway, um, congratulations in your RV. Cool light. Damn it, What's we want to name it something. What's it called? Cool light? No. Mini light. Mini light. <laughs> like your, cool like light. Little it's like a beard. Penis. Can we name it something? On the side? Oh. You know how people Mom! Name save her! Three cats. You know Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, go. Oh my god. Stop! <laughs> Drama. They think there's food in here. <laughs> oh, I washed it. <gasps> hey! Okay. Oh. Okay, I don't want it. Best of let him go. Stop. I'm probably making somebody out there really mad at PETA. <laughs> what are you doing, baby? What are you doing? Smokey's the best, for the what record. What are you doing? Autumn's all right. She just scratches. Sigh. Anyway, going back to our previous conversation, Dad wasn't trying to be rude. He's just being honest. That's all. And supportive of you. And supportive of me. You're yeah. But I will say, I can... No, get, get, get it over here. I can get it over here. No, no. No, am I pointing? Pointing's rude, right? Oh, well, boy. haters are haters are rude. Power no, points. No, you know, Michael Scott. No, the, the thing about haters is they're normally <laughs> uneducated people that don't know what the hell they're talking about. And most of them, no offense, they're high school kids who again don't know what the hell they're talking about. But not all. Not all. Well, but most. But there's no need to hate. If you don't want to donate, don't donate. I know. You are not the kind of person. Get it back and over you're here. Far from Get it back over hey, here. You guys wanted to do this no, for me. No, I no, no. One more thing. Know. A little misconception out there. Okay, everything I have, I worked for my entire life. Nobody gave me a damn thing except love and generosity. David, Thank he you. hasn't been given anything from us. Except I did, well, give him, I, did, I did give him an original back pro as a college gift. Hello? But I took that and turned it into other things. It's a tool. And that's pretty much it. Other than that, he's on his own. His house, his rent, his taxes, his car payment, it's all him. So those of you that don't student know what the loans. hell you're talking about, student, student loans. loans. A lot of money. Those of you that don't know what the hell you're talking about, just shut up. Peace. <laughs> That's a bit. No, I'm not gonna hide. Okay, whatever. Well, no, we hate to that's see a, your. It's a bit severe. We hate to see your no, I know. news. I know. Dampened by. It's all good. Idiots. But for the amazing people out there, thank you. We. And I'm not saying just anyone. For the record, I called it. I said he would get the money in a day. I did. Yeah, get... I think you said a day. I did. That's you a day's did. insane. You didn't want to do it. You were hesitant. I no, said... I was definitely hesitant. 
And I said, Dave, you have so many supporters out there that will be so happy to help you. Yes, believe me, I'm very grateful. It is amazing. And another $5 donation just, just came in. It is amazing. It's quite nice. Thank you. Now, if you want to help with the student loans... No, that I can do myself. <laughs> that's that's my own responsibility. I've been doing that for years now. In the RV. We could use... <laughs> my student loans will be paid off in what? Seven years? Probably not even. No. Not. How long I think they were ten years. I hate student loans. How long have you been out of college? They were ten years old. I graduated in 09. Nine? Oh, 2019. 2019. Oh, God. I hate student loans. Let me just say this real quick. College is important, but I don't so believe it's necessary to be successful. It helps. Oh, yeah, it helps. Not, not with my line of work, Sets though. That's the foundation. Right? That, are a good, that are a good trade school. Yes. Electrician, plumber, iron worker. Okay, those people. my arm hurts. Ice cream chopped This clip is going longer than I expected. <laughs> but, Mom and Dad were nice enough to bring me coffee. Yes, we were. Peace. Smoke a dope is still living. I don't know what I don't know what to say. I'm just using a clip to cut to there because apparently Dad wants to say something else. People that piss me off don't live. Watch out for Smokey. Hey, it's smoking. People don't live very long. So don't my son. Dad? No, no, stop, stop. Cut that. That's a good, that's a good blue though, okay? Kidding. No, no. That's what I want to say. Actually, no. I can, I can censor that out to be fun. No. Should I? No. No, I'll, I'll do like a bleep. No. Over, yeah. That's fine. Anyway, I'll even put the little pixels over your mouth. All right. Getting back to the, uh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Getting back to the whole. Oh, God. Theme, oh God. what's going on here. If anything, by the way, let them anyone, know you're anyone, not fighting my battle. I can do it myself. No, 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 no. I just, I they just, just want to chime in. I'm very socially involved with a lot of things. If anything, if you, you know, whether you hate or you like, anyone who's been involved with this should be amazed how how strong, how overwhelming social media can be. To raise that kind of money in 24 hours is amazing. Less than 12, actually, it was insane. So that is really, really awesome, and Agreed. it shows that there's a lot of good people out there. So that's all I have to say. More on so. David's fire side chat or whatever you're gonna call it. Remember? David's uh, fire side chat. Yeah. Smoky yeah. butt. Jammy. Uh, I gotta go. We just got ourselves an RV. Not with that money, of course. I gotta go empty the shit. <laughs> Use my funds. I gotta go pump the shitter out. So, yeah. right. I don't have it yet. Oh, did you see Sully's comment? Yeah. yeah. It's a view it's car. A view yeah, car. it's a vehicle. I love that. I don't even need a bad subject, but we've been in for a while. We still have a key. No, don't don't put that in there. <laughs> Don't I really have to. Talk. I really have to go. It's almost seven o'clock. I'm gonna do a live stream. Hunter Pants is always panting. Come here, Hunter. How are you? You love the snow, don't you? You do. No, you're not going outside. Yeah, on camera. Mr. Pants, I'm leaving. Come on, let's get our heartfelt goodbye on camera. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mom and Dad are going to finish Bates Motel tonight, the last three episodes. I'm so glad I got them watching that show. Such a great show. Um, if you guys are looking for like a slightly horror, it's more drama uh, type of show, definitely watch it. I don't think you'll be disappointed. It's directly connected with the original Psycho movies, which I've never seen the first one. I've seen the 90s version. Um, I'm not going to spoil the movie in case you haven't seen it, but watch all three if you can. Hopefully the original is on Netflix. I don't think it is. But if it is, maybe I'll watch that tonight after I stream. We'll see. I think we're just going to do the perks tomorrow. Because it's going to be a lot of work. And by the time I get back tonight, um, at the streaming, I'm going to be tired. And it's going to take a lot of organization, a lot of hours, too. Because I've had over 200 people donate, which is just incredible. You, you guys are just awesome. Smoke! Okay, let's go home. See you guys at DeFranco Media Headquarters with the Mal. I am home. Yeah, it's very wet outside. But I love it. There's something cool about stepping out onto hard snow and just having mounds for an obstacle. I just think it's pretty cool. Anyway, look how puffy my backpack is this time. It has my MacBook Pro in it. Um, and my clothes and everything else, including my Finder Pillow, my iPad Mini. My unpack. Enjoy a very quick dinner. I got apples and peanut butter. That's not a real dinner. But I also have a Danish, a cherry Danish from Pisker's Bakery. My parents went there. I'll have that for dessert while I stream on PS4. So, in other words, I'm really not going to have a good dinner tonight. That's okay. I don't really want a good dinner. I just kind of want food. 
Hey, food is food. I've been streaming for about an hour now. I decided to not stream out less because I wasn't sure if I felt like dealing with all the squares. Yeah, squares, really. I'm saying squares because I'm playing sound shapes. But yeah, I didn't really feel like dealing with that tonight. I just wanted to relax, answer questions, and play sound shapes, which is a nice, chill game. And there are the viewers. We got Piz, BCK, Camp, Tanner, Miles. I'm sorry if I say anyone's name wrong. My DualShock 4 keeps flashing with the beat. I love that. You really can't see it. Oh, let's do that. There you go. It's pretty cool. And we have somebody else saying gay. Heavy Bud123 is one of those people you do not want to interact with. Waste of space. Tanner516. I think I said that already. Uh, Maj, Maj Frazier. Lightify, Jessica Q Gaming, Dylan Bizarro, and let's do one more. As soon as it comes through. Twitch has a delay on this stream since I'm doing it on the PS4. And the Evid guy in WWE. There it all goes. And there you go, another successful preview of my stream, if you want to call this a preview. Don't forget to follow me at Twitch. I think twitch.tv slash defranco gaming, I guess that's it. Either way, just go to defrancogaming.com slash live. And that's how you can find me on Twitch and all that information. And hopefully soon past streams. I know they don't archive PS4 streams yet, but I heard a while back that they plan to do that eventually. So hopefully that's soon because it would be nice to look back on streams such as this. And especially last week's stream on Atlast. That was just insane. So all right, that's it. I'll see you in the next Clippity clip. I need coffee. I'm installing the new Xbox One software update. Exciting times. Apparently this update installs two very important things, I think. Uh, number one, battery percentage levels on your controllers, which it should have been there to begin with. It was on the Xbox 360. I don't know. But hey, it's here, so I'm not going to complain. And number two, file management. Finally. Not that it's a huge deal. I mean, I haven't had any real issues with file management on the Xbox One yet. It's pretty easy to uninstall a game. But still, file management is always good. So anyway, awesome stream. Thank you guys so much for coming out over at defrancogaming.com slash live. I really, really did have a lot of fun. I just love streaming my PS4 because it's so relaxing. I mean, I get to play video games and talk to you guys rather than being tethered to my desk. Again, I get to play video games and talk to you at the same time. It just, it doesn't get better than that. That is the ultimate streaming, I love it. And I cannot wait until when Twitch stream, uh, streaming eventually comes to the Xbox One. That's gonna be sweet. So I'll have best of both worlds, PS4 and Xbox One. Now heating up Z Coffee for a long time, minute 30 seconds. It's just what I do. I love my late night coffee. All right, for the freaking Hundredth time, I'm finally gonna work on the perks. I'm gonna email everyone right now per perk, which is really nice. So everybody who donated $25, I can email all of them at once requesting your information. I can email all those who donated just like, you know, $5. I don't say just in that sense, you know what I mean? Just comparing in terms of uh, numeric amounts, numerical amounts, is that the right word? Um, and then for those who donated $100, I can email all of them at the same time. It's awesome. I love how easy Indiegogo makes it for me because I have I've had I think 220 people donate since so far, which is just incredible. And again, no matter your size of donation, a dollar, ten dollars, a hundred, five hundred, whatever, guys, please know, it really does mean a lot to me. And I cannot say that enough. You're probably sick of me thanking you already, but this really, really, really is a huge deal. So huge that I've turned it into a silhouette. Yay! We have a new tab. Well, not a new tab, but a new uh, little box. Newest features, let's see. Is it a video or is it just a list? Okay, here we go. Frag and brag, record and upload your while this gameplay is blah, 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 blah. Wasn't that already there? I'm not sure. Maybe it wasn't, I don't know. Uh, power play. Check how much juice is left in your controller, which is good. Yes, have keyboard will travel. Oh, that's right. You can use a USB keyboard to chat now, which is pretty cool. I'm not going to use it personally, but hey, it's there for people who want it. Improved performance. Enjoy playing your favorite games with music. 
good because I gotta say the Xbox One interface was always a little laggy since launch, so that's good. And streamlined content management, so that's cool. So the next major software update should be Twitch integration. Oh, actually, you see that? Hold on. Huh. The frame rate actually does does look smoother. I mean, it wasn't too bad before, but it looks like the frame rate is a lot smoother than it was. Thank you. I'm all about smoothness. I just love that smooth experience. Oh, there it is. My controller indicator, you see that? Hold on, let me push a button, it should appear. Wait, hold on, what am I doing? I'm not even looking at the camcorder, there it is. Battery indicator. Sorry, that's beautiful camera work. Xbox, turn off. Yes. There it goes. Good night, Xbox, I'll, I will, I won't talk to you, well I guess I'll technically talk to you tomorrow when I turn you on. Ooh, baby. Guys, this is really crazy. It's 4 o'clock in the morning. I'm just now finishing sending out emails to all the contributors thus far. I created exclusive forms that only they can see because I made up all these email templates that I split up in the categories per perk for $5, $10, $25, $50, $100, $250, $250 rather, and $500. Look at it. All right, so as you can see, I have a perk per form. So in other words, I'm keeping things extremely organized. Where is it? Thanks to Wufu. Seriously, check them out. They're not a sponsor. They don't even know I exist. WUFOO.com if you're looking for a form manager or a form creator software. Again, form, like contact form, not forum, like message boards. Awesome. I gladly pay a monthly fee, and it's just an awesome service, and it's because of them. This is going to be really freaking organized, which is awesome. And, yeah. I'm not adding the names and stuff to my website until tomorrow. I am going to bed, but as you can see, I'm not going to show people's information or whatever. The emails are quickly coming in, even though it's 4 a.m. So that is a good sign. So definitely check it out. DavidDeFranco.com slash Mac Pro Contributors. That link is right below. Thank you guys. You're amazing. The weekend vlog is not done yet, but I'll see you in the morning. So in other words, it really is an awesome value. This isn't just about contributing towards me. It's about giving back in terms of video promotion and getting people's content out there. That's what it's all about. This whole thing is a win-win scenario for everyone. And this, this is a great deal. All this promotion I'm doing just giving back in terms of views and whatever, that that would normally cost at least $150 in terms of the video promotion alone and not including a link on my website, links in other videos and stuff like that. Um, if I had to estimate, all that promotion right there on that single piece of paper is probably worth at least, let me say, $300 and he's getting it for $100. So, just something to keep in mind. Just want people to know out there that I am giving back in the best way I can in terms of stuff I enjoy with video promotion, content creation, and all that stuff. Okay, now I am going to bed. It's nearly 4.30 a.m. Guys, thank you so much. I will see you in the morning. I did not just flip you off. Sorry about that. Good morning, my fellow viewers. How the heck are you? Welcome to Sunday's edition. Well, really part two. Technically part three, if you want to get really, really technical because I started on Friday night. Yes, this vlog feels longer than usual. I don't know, because I've been recording for a while. Anyway, guys, how are you? It's technically afternoon, if, yeah, you want to be exact on time. So, I don't think I've ever sat in this counter. I just want to say, guys, you are awesome. Once again, I woke up to a $250 Donations. So now the Mac Pro campaign is at approximately, I think, $4,461. Yeah, I say approximately, but I just did the exact dollar amount because I just happened to check right now. Thank you again, guys. I'm sorry. I'm going to get annoying with how much thanks I'm giving out, but it's just awesome. It's just awesome. So I am listening to my Zelda music because I know you guys like, well, I know some of you like my video game music in the morning. And if you want the exact track, it doesn't say right here. It's not gonna... Oh crap, I'm not even on Wi-Fi. 
Why am I not on Wi-Fi? It's turned on. Really? I just press next. Oh well. Okay, so I have three goals in mind today, and one of them easily outweighs the other two. Yeah, you could probably guess right now. Number one, my primary goal today is to complete all these campaign details. I came in overnight. That's everybody's name and email addresses and their, well, not their emails, but but, but their links of choice, rather, uh, that will be posted on davidfranken.com slash macprocontributors. Again, links right below. I probably just said that last night, though. It's okay. Um, as well as video advertising that I got to do. Um, I got to record a bunch of, um, well, no, that's more integrated in future videos, but you know what I mean. It's just overwhelming with how much response I'm getting and people are responding so quickly which makes my job easier that way I can get your name up on the website because I technically got the money as I showed you guys yesterday um, so you have the right to have your perk fulfilled as soon as possible at least those are that are, that are possible I can't do the perks that are part of the Mac Pro unboxing yet I'll do that in like maybe two months depends when I get the Mac Pro it's the only thing that sucks, the Mac Pro is on a, like, apparently on a severe shortage, so I probably won't get mine until at least April. But hey, that's okay, at least I'm pretty much, no, at least I'm 100% guaranteed a Mac Pro thanks to your support. It's just incredible. There I go again. such an idiot. I did this and I pressed the record button on the camcorder instead of the uh, speaker. Yeah, I'll, I really screwed that up this weekend. I've been doing YouTube for about eight years yet I still make the same mistakes. Just proves that I'm human. The office is playing. All right, but before I dive into my campaign work again, I'm going to enjoy a nice cup of coffee and a bowl of Frosted Flakes, which just happens to be one of my favorite cereals. Mm. They're great! Mr. James Halpert! I love that episode, The Office, when Andy has his garden party at Shrewd Farms. Man, I would hate to have a dad like Andy's dad. He's such a jerk. Just watching it is uncomfortable. I can't imagine being raised in a family like that. Just. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just incredibly thankful and grateful that I was raised in a good household. Close the door! It is time to get Z-Perks done. Well, at least started, because I'm obviously going to have more perks over time. But this is easily the majority. I have like over 200 to get through, I think. Maybe 150. He does some uh, unboxing videos, tech videos, generally kind of geeky lifestyle stuff. I like David. I think he's kind of funny and he's got a unique way of looking at things and I find his work to be entertaining, sometimes educational. You know, he's got a Mac Pro he bought back in 2006. It's really getting old. He can't run the latest grading operating system on it. Uh, so he decided on Valentine's Day, after talking to his audience, to yeah, that, start a... Uh, that's the key a, uh, phrase right there. Account. After talking to my audience. I'm not trying to rub this in too much, but I'm just saying Frugal Tech gets me. He understands me as a person. He understands my motives. So Frugal Tech, if you're watching, and you probably are, thank you. Although I don't know if you watch my weekend vlogs. They're kind of lengthy, and I'm sure you're a busy person. But if you are watching, thank you so much. Your name sounds extremely familiar. Um, I may have tweeted you before. I'm sorry. I've never honestly watched your videos before, but I like your style, so I will be subscribing and I will be putting your link below. Not just because you support me, but because you seem to create quality content, which is something I greatly respect. But anyway, Frugal Tech, I just wanted to thank you very much for appreciating um, my content, my campaign, and me as a person, and seeing this from my perspective. It just really means a lot to me because I've done, I mean, I've dealt with a lot of flack this weekend. As predicted though, I mean, I knew going into this that I would get a lot of hate in return, but What's the point of living a life if you're not willing to take a risk, right? I mean, I took a risk and I succeeded. I'm not trying to sound egotistical when I say that, but I took a risk and I succeeded. And I honestly feel good about that because not only did I set a goal for myself and I succeeded much, much sooner than I expected to, but this campaign has 
downright proven that I have some downright generous viewers and supporters out there. I mean, I know this is like the theme of this vlog and I'm repeating myself, I'm sorry. There's just no other way to say it. I'm still surprised at how quickly this thing has gone and it's not even done yet. Again, it doesn't end till, till um, the 15th of April and I can't end it early, which makes me feel a little guilty. But I promise that money will be will be put towards maybe the six core model or a Thunderbolt display. But anyway, I've said it before. So Frugal Tech, thank you again. Um, don't forget to check out his link below. Great guy, G great, great attitude. G seriously, great attitude. I'm tripping over my words here, but it's just a sigh of relief to see such a positive response to my campaign. So thank you very much. I'll send a message. I'll have a whole conversation. It's one sided conversation. And then I'll ask the person, did you, get, did you get any of those? And she'll say, no. And then a day later, the phone goes crazy. 15 messages come in. Leo Laporte is keeping me entertained while I input over 100 of people's names. Oh, let me show you this real quick. This is how organized I am. Guys, I'm taking this very seriously. I have all the supporters broken down into categories. So $25 promotion, $50 promotion, $100 promotion, $250 promotion. Now I am about to email the person who was kind enough to donate $500. This is allowing me to stay sane because I'm dealing with a lot of information. And because you guys are so generous to support me, I don't want to screw this up. So basically it's going to be perfect no matter what. And by the way, for some reason, if you donated and you did not get an email, let me know. I'll look up your name, look up your email, and I'll send you the form of which you can reply with all the required information. But uh, anyway, I am about to eat a very, very late lunch. It's 420. I've been working on this for at least two hours now, which isn't a lot of time, but still. This is what I love to do, so I don't mind. Um, I'm gonna have another egg salad sandwich. Yeah, I know it looks gross and I know the thought of eggs, but I love it um, My mom was nice enough to let me bring home the remainder since I'm very low on food seriously, I it's, I, uh, I don't know. I'm thinking I'm gonna starve. No, not literally, but I am extremely low on food I definitely definitely have to go food shopping next weekend. What am I looking for? Uh, just a paper plate fine. Um, but I will be at mom and dad's house again from Thursday through Saturday watching the pets because they're going to Atlantic City again It just happens to be two weekends in a row, but that's fine That means more content for you guys because my weekend vlog will be plenty of pet footage and maybe snow if we get another snowstorm um, So good things ahead Let me back up that way you can't see people's emails, but uh, you see the highlight at yellow That means I've emailed all those people and that's not even all of them I had to scroll up on that side because the document's too big, so I had to scroll down a bit. Let me just say this again. A lot of work is going into making this possible. It's not all fun and games for me because I have the money. I mean, I have to... There's a lot of behind-the-scenes work emailing people per perks, you know, per each perk, because the higher donators, like the people who donate $100, don't only get the $100 perk. They also get the perks that include 5, 10, 25, and 50. So I had to create forms on Wufu specifically for those people. Um, and then it got even more complicated when I got to 250 and $500. Um, it's not hard at all. It's, it's really not hard. You just gotta have a clear mindset. Sorry, Leo's kind of loud. Um, and, and you just gotta concentrate, that's all. But it actually is enjoyable. It's a good learning experience. Uh, but I don't think I'll be having to do this again. No. This is probably a one-time thing in my life. Unless I create some kind of like actual product that needs funding, but I don't think I'm ever gonna create a product. And there you have it. My Mac Pro Contributors page is officially live. If you are on that page, you are just awesome. And this is just the beginning. I'm sure I'm going to get a lot more um, emails in the near future because obviously everyone I've contacted within 24 hours hasn't responded yet. So this is just stage one. Expect many more names on that page. Okay, so... Hold on, let me move my DSLR out of here. Taking a break from work, basically, because yes, I do work on the weekend. It's what I do. Where is it? Right here. I got this around Christmas time. 
or maybe like soon after Christmas and I am incredibly sorry for taking so long. Obviously I've been pretty busy and I've actually been away from the house the past few weekends. Um, at least before last weekend, which I meant to do this then, but then I forgot again and they emailed me. I was like, crap, I'm so sorry. Skipping to the point, this is a care package from Ben Vollert in, uh, don't want to say it wrong, Deutschland? Deutsch, Deutschland? Sorry if I said that wrong, but basically it's not from America, which makes it very fascinating. And yes, I am um, geographically challenged, which is why I probably just butchered that name. And Ben, I apologize, but thank you very much. Ben sent a little letter. He says, Dear David, it's finally Christmas time. <laughs> I'm so sorry, it's February now. And I wanted to send you something nice. So here's some of my favorite German sweets. I hope you like them. Keep doing your thing, Ben. So Ben, thank you so much. He sent me a bunch of snacks. So I promised him I would at least taste one or two of them because it's impossible to eat everything now and I still have to eat dinner. Uh, but I'll show you a preview at least. So this is Milka and Oreo. Just looking at the art of that, just the packaging, that looks amazing. And you know what? I'm gonna try that right now because this looks like something I would definitely enjoy. And I gotta say, international chocolate is easily better than American chocolate. Believe me, I fully realize that. I may not like the British version of The Office, but I do like some British candy. And yes, I realize this is German. What the? There you go, jeez. So, upon first sniff, it obviously smells like chocolate. There you go. Ooh, look at that. What's it have on the inside again? I guess Oreo bits. Mmm. Yo. That's good. That is banging. Thank you, Ben. That is so good. Okay. I wanted to swallow my chocolate. It'd be rude to talk. All right. This looks interesting. Haribo, um, Sal's Preslin, which I'm guessing means pretzel, hence the big freaking blue pretzel. You know what? There's not that much stuff in here. So I think I'll try each real quick. So here we go. Oh God, is this black licorice? Because I gotta be honest, I'm not a Black Licorice fan. But my god, look at that focus! Gotta love Panasonic. Hmm. I think that's Black Licorice. No offense, Ben, it's not, not your fault, I'm just not a fan. But, oh god, I'm sure that's very good to anyone else. Interested in that. So though, thank you. Okay, this is definitely more my speed. Looks like the caramels. Or caramel, as some people say. I say caramel. Ryzen? Let me open this. Alright, here we go. It's like a little brick. Oh, God. Ah! I'll eat that later. I, I don't want to pull out my crown. I have a crown right down here. Mm, that is sweet. But it's dark chocolate and it tastes good. Um, again, Ryzen, Dunkel, hold on. Dunkel de Chocolate, cho Chocolate, Craft Siege Caramel. I don't know, guys. Duplo? which I will not try right now, but I promise I will try off camera at some point. Ah, oh, that is sweet. It's like sticking to my tooth, my God. Um, oh my God. Must, I, I don't know, I have, I have a filling right there or something. Frigio, uh, Brows Bondons. Interesting. 
It's got like soda on the back. Or as you find people call it, cola. Let's open this. Ooh. They're like um, Pez. It looks like Pez. Maybe a little bigger. Oh my god. Those are sweet. Oh my god. Pure freaking sugar. It's good though. Very good. Oof. That will definitely wake you up if you're tired. And now finally, last but not least, this is fancy packaging. Uh, this is Nada Regar Lubeck Lo Siento. Yes, I realize I just spoke Spanish to Germans, but that's okay. I will open this. Real quick. I don't want to, want to make this clip too long. Let's see what this is. It's kind of thick. It says Zart Bitter, whatever that is. An even larger brick. Oh, soft. Oh God. Is this coconut? Be respectful, David. Force it down. I think it's coconut. I can't find anything about coconut. Almonds, bittersweet chocolate, cocoa mass, uh, sugar, cocoa butter, whole milk, powder, emulsifier, or whatever, soya, uh, lecithins, vanilla extract, sugar, invert, sugar syrup, alcohol. It certainly tastes like coconut, which I'm not a fan of. I'm sorry, I'm just being honest. I can't change my taste. But I gotta say, my favorite of all these is definitely the first chocolate bar that I did. There's food all over my thing now. This is awesome. Usually my favorite. So Ben, thank you again. I greatly appreciate your support and I greatly appreciate these random little goodies. So, thank you. Xbox on. Yes, my receiver just turned on. And my TV didn't. What the hell? It just turned on the other day. Oh, actually, you know what? I just installed the software update on the Xbox One, which may have reset something because I had to put in the specific model number of my Samsung TV. That's the only way it worked the first time. But shout out to so-and-so on Twitter. I'm sorry, I forget your name. He told me this like a week ago, or actually Monday when he saw me, my uh, weekend vlog, I think. Your Xbox One can indeed turn on your receiver and your TV, not just the Xbox One itself. It actually turns everything else on for you. It's hidden away in like the TV one guide settings or whatever it's called. You actually have to put in your TV's model number or you can just search for it. Um, you have to put in your receiver information and the Xbox One takes care of the rest. And I can have it set to turn them off as well but I don't want that because if I'm done playing video games I typically switch to my Apple TV for Netflix. Which I yes realize the Xbox One has Netflix. I don't prefer it though. I like my Apple TV. Um, but isn't that awesome? I can say Xbox on and my receiver and TV both turn on. That's just incredible because it always, because I've always wondered, um, it's cool turning on the Xbox One, but what about your receiver and TV? Why would I have to reach down and grab the remote? Why can't it do it for me? And it does, and I had no idea, and I got this thing on launch day, and I just found out like a week ago. I don't know, maybe I'm easily amused, which I know I am, but I just really appreciate convenience. And now this is the reason I turned my Xbox One on tonight. Titanfall, baby. Oh yeah. This should be really interesting. Confirm. Whoa, zoom out. Now I gotta be honest, I haven't really looked up much on Titanfall. That's just how I am. I don't really watch a lot of video game trailers or videos nowadays. I mean, I still love gaming. Obviously it's a huge, huge part of my life. Um, but maybe I'm not alone in this, but are you guys the same way? I don't like spoiling things for myself. I don't like watching too many trailers of video games or movies even. I don't really watch 
movie trailers because I feel like they spoil the experience. You know what's going to happen in a scene. You know a funny part's coming up. And the same thing for video games. I don't want to be spoiled if I see like a certain characters in there or you go to a certain setting. I, I just want to be wowed from the beginning. But with that said, I did watch one gameplay multiplayer video. I guess flip the words around. Multiplayer gameplay video of the Titanfall. I think it was the alpha. Not entirely sure, but I'm pretty sure it was the alpha. This was like a month or two ago. And it looked amazing. The multiplayer actually looked really freaking good. And it honestly looks like a sigh of relief because we haven't had anything revolutionary new in multiplayer in quite a while. I mean, I'm fine with playing your typical Halo games and Battlefield and Call of Duty and all that stuff. But you gotta be honest, we need something new. And apparently Titanfall brings that to the table. So it's gonna be really interesting to play. Now, not to tease you too much, but I'm gonna play this after the vlog, so I'll talk about Titanfall next weekend. Just remind me, tweet me on Friday, please, if you can. Saying, David, don't forget to mention Titanfall because I'm not gonna be here most of the weekend, so I could forget, but I probably won't forget. You know me, I like to talk about anything. So guys, I'm actually gonna sign off. Thank you so much for watching this weekend vlog. Hopefully it was exciting. Thinking back, I don't think I did anything too exciting. I kinda just, I mean, I talked about the campaign, which is obviously exciting in itself, but besides that, I showed, what, egg salad and snow? But hey, you guys enjoy it, right? Hopefully. Um, but guys, please know from the bottom of my heart, not to get all sappy, but seriously, you guys are incredible. Just thank you so much for being you. Each and every one of you who was nice enough to donate, I owe my life to you. I promise it will be worth it. <laughs> Just... Expect awesome content regarding the Mac Pro. I cannot wait to experience this with you guys. And don't forget, it's not just about me, it's about you too. When I, not, no, not the band. I didn't even have to say that. You guys know what I'm talking about, it's just a stupid joke. Um, I forget the person's name, I'm sorry, I read tons of comments every day. But somebody even on YouTube said when I was proposing the idea about Indiegogo two weeks ago, they said, you know what, David? It's going to be cool seeing you unbox the Mac Pro because we as a community can say, yeah, we made that possible. We are making this video happen right now because of our, because of our donations. And you're absolutely right. The unboxing would not happen without you. So guys, thank you. Digital hug. I love you guys in a, you know, like a bro kind of way. The cool kind of love, you know. Seriously though, guys, you're just awesome. And I'll see you in tomorrow's video, which is all about The Office, which I realize only appeals to so many people. All right, this is a long clip. You guys are awesome. Peace. See you tomorrow. Enjoy your week.